in the land of grills. And as my wife would say, it's getting out of control again, Tom. And she's right, because there's a new, one, a new one in the box and there's more coming. But I just want to sear some steaks. I, all I think about here lately is searing steaks. And I'm always looking for something to, you know, hot, 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 and let's sear them. And, and today we're gonna go top shelf today. So the Acorn Junior, folks uh, from Char Griller, if you're looking for a smaller Acorn, a Kamado, uh, cast iron, uh, double insulated and all that, and it can sear like crazy, let's get her, it's gonna take a while for me to weave through and get that grill down. But we're gonna get that grill down, we're gonna fire it up with some of all, oh, you know what we're gonna do? The b, &B. yeah, the best right there. Hotter, longer, cleaner, Ace Hardware folks. We're gonna get it fired up, give you a look-see. You know, I've had a few people ask me about, because it's a small Kamado, and saying, Tom, can you really indirect on that? And you can see it down there, is that uh, they actually make, yeah, there it is. They, they have a plate in there, a stainless steel plate, that's obviously removable, and uh, that gives you the opportunity to do low and slow, indirect. Take that off, see you've got some lump in there. And uh, it's double insulated, and there's an inner firebox. Fire that up, open up that bottom vent, and away we're gonna go. It's gonna get it's gonna get hot. So when it comes to lighting charcoal, folks, this thing should almost be illegal. So <laughs> it is just uh, uh, you'll understand what I'm talking about. You're saying, oh, really? That's nothing. Hey, yeah, you ain't you ain't seen nothing yet. Talking about? That's crazy. Just like that, you got fire. I, I tell you what, <laughs> grill gun from Grill Blazer, <laughs> check them out, it's phenomenal. <laughs> After 20 minutes, look at that, almost 700 degrees. B&B &B uh, &B is the only one that can do that, folks. I'm, I'm telling you what, this thing gets hot, hot, hot. Now, let's open it up. Take a look at it. Gotta be careful here. Burp it. Yeah, look at that. We, oh my gosh, that is so hot. So you wanna see how I'm cooking on there? Chuck eye steaks, folks, these are very cheap, very inexpensive, and uh, I like the hell out of them. And we're, we're gonna put them on cast iron, and it's the cast iron grates right there. Now, I use this stuff because it does not flare up. Look at that, 650 degrees, no flare up. So hot I can't even get close to it. Let's go here. Just like that, we're gonna give them maybe a minute and we'll flip them, give you a look. <laughs> this is a seasoning I use, folks. I'll tell you what, it's awesome. All right, so typically at this point at one minute, you would give it a quarter turn. But being that it's 650 degrees, and I know it's hot, 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 I am just going to flip, flip, flip. Yeah, see that? That's nice. Real nice. Put it down now. Steaks cool down the cast iron a little bit, so I'm gonna let this go for about two, two and a half minutes. Give you a look-see. <laughs> Smokes are rolling. <laughs> Let's take a look. All right, so three minutes. Yeah. These are done. Three minute steaks. Without a doubt. Give you a look-see once you're plated up. All right, folks, about three, three, four minutes. Like I said, I like them charred. And then, uh, go. Like that in the middle. Oh, man, that's going to be so good. Let's uh, take a taste test, shall we? Favorite way to make steak is just to get it hot, hot, hot. That was 650 degrees. Oh man, oh. I'm telling you what folks, 
That's good stuff right there. Acorn, char griller, come on, old folks, check it out. Tom Horseman YouTube, thumbs up, leave a comment. I'll leave a link down below to a review I did on this grill. And as always, thanks for watching.